Over the next 20 years, U.S. energy demand is expected to increase by 28% while the U.S. is simultaneously facing growing pressure to cut down on the carbon emissions associated with energy production. The most cost-effective way to meet future energy demand while cutting carbon emissions is to further implement natural gas as a source for electricity generation. The U.S. energy grid relies heavily on outdated, expensive, and environmentally harmful sources of energy. The U.S. consumes more energy per capita than any other country in the world, according to the U.S. Energy Information Agency. Our carbon emissions have fallen 758 million cubic tons per year since 2005, the biggest decrease of any country in the world. The U.S. surpassed Russia as the largest natural gas producer in the world in 2008, and in 2015, we produced 28.8 trillion cubic feet of natural gas. With energy being the largest source of carbon emissions in the U.S., change is still needed to refine our energy grid. The U.S. produced 16.5 cubic tons per capita of CO2 emissions in 2016, according to the World Bank, the highest um, per capita CO2 emissions of any country in the world. With U.S. energy demand expected to increase 28% by 2040, it is essential if we want to continue to cut carbon emissions while expanding our energy grid for future demand, it's essential that we um, transition into natural gas and away from more harmful energy sources like coal. Natural gas has been the main cause of the significant decrease in carbon dioxide emissions over the last decade. Natural gas will help the U.S. and the rest of the world cut carbon emissions. CO2 emissions from the natural gas power plants are up to 66% lower than our traditional coal power plants, according to Yale Climate Connections. Natural gas costs $53.8 per megawatt hour to produce on average, compared to $128.9 for coal, $96.2 for nuclear, and $73.7 for solar. With U.S. production increasing at unprecedented rates, there has been a, a, a huge surge in the U.S. market of cheap natural gas. This natural gas is currently sending the outdated coal industry out of business, and it is, an, it is estimated that this transition from natural gas or from coal to natural gas production has contributed as much as two fifths of the 11% drop in carbon dioxide emissions since 2007. The most cost effective way to lower carbon dioxide emissions in the US is through a transition from less environmentally friendly energy sources like coal and petroleum to natural gas. A cleaner and more efficient energy model would see natural gas essentially place coal entirely. According to the EIA, U.S. coal production dropped from roughly 1 billion short tons in 2010 to roughly 750 million in 2017, realizing a 25% drop in production in only seven years. 2018 is on track to be even lower than 2017, and ideally this trend will continue into the future as the commodity is replaced by more cost-effective, environmentally friendly methods. Now, the most effective way to help the growth of natural gas is through investment. Giving natural gas companies money to grow will help the expansion of the industry and will make you money in the process. So I want to talk about three natural gas stocks that you can make money on. Number one is Chesapeake Energy, uh, stock ticker CHK. It is a good natural gas investment as the company has more exposure to natural gas than any other publicly traded energy company in the U.S. They're investing more and more in natural gas as a fuel sources and have been seeing upset. Number two would be UNG or the United States Natural Gas Fund. This is a publicly traded natural gas ETN that tracks the underlying price of natural gas in a one to one ratio with a 0.7 net expense ratio. The last one is going to be UGAS. UGAS is an ETN that is three times leverage to the underlying price of natural gas. It is similar to UNG that it trades in a much, larger, a much larger range and is three times as volatile. It is suited for short-term long positions on natural gas. In conclusion, natural gas is one of the cheapest energy sources to produce and is cleaner than conventional energy sources, making it the ideal energy source to integrate into the U.S. energy grid in higher numbers. As we prepare for a future with more demand for energy than ever before, as well as more demand for clean energy, a transition to natural gas will help the U.S. cut down on carbon emissions and help U.S. producers cut down on costs. 
If you want to make a difference, invest in CHK, REGI, or UNG for long-term exposure, or UGAS if you know what you're doing and are more into speculative, short-term leverage positions.